Hey guys, Ryan Salson here with Accelerate Marketing. And today I'm going to talk to you about how you can add geo modifiers into your Google local service ads page in order to get the results that you're used to getting with your search engine optimization from your Google business profile page or your regular SEO for your website that you've been doing. As you know, you can add cities, neighborhoods, zip codes to blog posts, to your Google business profile page in order to make sure that your website and your Google business profile page show up for those particular places. And you can do the same thing with Google local service ads because it's a paid ad unit. You specifically identify the same cities, neighborhoods, zip codes, et cetera, counties that you would in the content that you create in order to make sure that your local service ads page shows up. You would identify those in the ad setup, okay? So I'm gonna give you some very, very good tips today that are gonna help you stay ahead <laughs> of your competition and crush it with your local service ad so that you get as many leads as you possibly can for the lowest cost possible. Okay, so the first thing you wanna do is sign up for your Google local service ad page. You wanna go in, go to where it says service areas, identify those areas that you wanna show up for. You wanna add those cities, those counties, those areas that you wanna show up for, okay? In that service area section. I've seen many businesses not even, really even do this very well. I would go a little bit wider than normal in order to see what kind of lead volume you can get and then try to ratchet it in over time. The other thing you wanna do is you wanna update your business information. You definitely wanna make sure that you add your correct address with your Google local service ads page, your correct phone number. Obviously, you got your zip code there that will give Google an identification of the area that you're in as well. So any of these geo identifying tips are very good for optimizing your LSA or Google local service ads page because it lets Google know that you're local. If you have a local phone number, then Google knows that you're a local business. So you wanna make sure that you use a local area code and that you put your local address in that LSA page. The other thing that you can do is you can leverage local keywords in any type of text that you put in your Google local service ad page. Also, you can leverage this in the photos that you add, okay? So you could even add geo-modifying keywords in your title of your business. As long as you have it registered with the state, you can very well just add a geo-modifier in the title of your business. A lot of businesses are actually putting what it is that they do in the title. These are things that you can do. There's not a lot of other geo-modifying keywords that you can add uh, because there's not really too much more that you can do other than make sure that you've got your address added to the Google local service ad page and that you've got your local area phone number. The other thing that you could do is you could add local images. Now, Google just recently said that they're getting much more lenient on the images that it's allowing businesses to post on their Google local service ads page. So you want to make sure that you show local landmarks that people are gonna recognize very easily from your local market. This will allow them to know that you are a local business, that you are one of the businesses that understands the area, they're gonna recognize it, and I'm telling you, it will increase the conversion rate that you get and increase the phone numbers or the phone calls that you get from people that are looking for your type of business on Google. There's not much that you can really separate yourself with in the Google local service ads pages. So those photos, as you'll notice, they show up right at the top of your Google local service ads page. So if you have your business, maybe your trucks, maybe whatever, with a landmark, a local landmark in the background or something else local that people recognize, that will significantly help you. The other thing that you wanna do, as you guys know, no video would be complete without mentioning one of the three R's. So it's reviews. You wanna make sure that you're getting reviews from local people that have used your company, use your service, use your whatever it is that you offer and ask them, will you leave us a review? 
you can get a review on your Google business profile page that will then be shared to your local service ads page. The other is that you can actually get a verified review by sending out a link for your Google local service ad page. And we can show you how to do that. These are strategies that will definitely help you as you probably already know, Google local service ad reviews, they do not go to your Google business profile page. They stay as a verified review and they rise at the top of your Google local service ads page. If you have any questions on how to do this, you can text us. We'll be happy to help you 619-304-5155. So the other thing that you can do is we can track performance by your geography. We can actually identify where the calls are coming from. And this is one of the reasons why we recommend wholeheartedly to use some sort of a call tracking platform so that you can identify where your phone calls are coming from. What city, what neighborhood, what zip code, what county are your phone calls predominantly coming from so that you can know where to place your budget. If you really want to get very specific, you can put all your budget behind a certain area. If you see that you're getting most of your phone calls from there, or if you know that's a really good neighborhood where you're seeing that you're getting a, a low cost per conversion. So this is why it's really important because you can see this data in any sort of call tracking platform that's halfway decent. We recommend a few of them. In order to increase the response rate, we recommend using a call tracking platform. And I'm not talking about a call service, I'm talking about a call tracking platform in order to make sure that all your calls are answered. And of course, that's the other R, which is response rate. So we wanna make sure that response rate is as high as possible. And that's the other reason why we recommend using a call tracking platform in addition to identifying where in terms of a geography that those people are calling from so that you can really ratchet in where to spend your budget. And then finally, the other way to optimize the radius or the third R is to set up other Google local service ad pages. And because we are a Google local service ad partner, we have access to data from Google that tells us exactly where there is the best opportunity for you, whether you're a, a doctor, a lawyer, a real estate agent, a plumber, an electrician, if you're running or you can run Google local service ads, we can tell you where to open up your next location based on where there is the least amount of competition on the Google local service ads platform and where there's the most search volume. And we get that data directly from Google. So we can tell you where the areas are that you would be best to open up your next location so that you have more fishing poles in the water. So if you're fishing, you wanna have more fishing poles in the water so that you have the greatest likelihood of catching fish. The more poles in the water, the more chance you have to catch fish. So that's why it's the three R's and not just the two R's. So it's reviews, response rate, and radius. Today, I talked a lot about geo-targeting and radius. Hopefully you guys got some value out of it. Just to summarize, there's a lot of strategies that range from adding additional locations to adding pictures that focus on local landmarks to making sure that you use a local area code to making sure that you input the right service areas in the setup process or afterwards. There's a lot of strategies that can be implemented in order to make sure that you are showing up for people that are searching for you locally. Give me a like if you like this information. Let me know if you got any questions. And again, I will respond to you. If you want my free training on how to really optimize and crush it with Google Local Service Ads, you can just text the acronym LSA to 619-304-5155. It's totally free. And uh, we'll talk to you soon. Thanks. Bye-bye.